I'm about to show y'all one of the greatest convenience stores. Indomart, but not any Indomart. It's gotta be Indomart fresh. It's gotta have a point coffee. This one is extreme. I've been in, I've been in Surabaya just scoping them out and I found one. Not only we have a drive-through, but it's massive. And uh, we're about to get a lot of stacks to go and try. And I'm gonna show you why Point Coffee is the best coffee in Indonesia. Oh, hello, Jack. Hello, Jack. Mau apa, Jack? Uh, mau uh, gula, gula, gula Jawa latte. Oh, gula Jawa okay. latte. Pam sugar latte satu. Yes. Gulanya sedikit. Gula sedikit hmm. apa banyak? Enggak sedikit. Normal. Normal. Esnya normal. Normal. Gelas kecil apa gede? Gelas kecil atau besar? Ten days, not bad. Got it now. You have a good teacher. <laughs> Anyways, while he's ordering that, we're gonna go look. So look, they have like sandwiches and things you can get. That one actually looks pretty good. I don't really want to eat fruit. Yeah, look at this. This mango does look good. I didn't come here for fruit. If I want fruit, I go to the market. Everything. This is what I want. I want snacks. Now everybody knows Indomie. So I'm not gonna waste my time eating it. I wanna find snacks that maybe you haven't seen, maybe you don't know about. Let's get a basket. So that's kind of what I'm gonna to do today. I drink a lot of Picari sweats because I run. I like to get my vitamins minerals back. They have the low calorie version in Indonesia. So much better than that. What is this? Gato kacha. Well, I can't read this. Was it leche? I don't know, let's try one. Oh, so we gotta get some chips. Kachang, so we got peanuts. Peanuts coated in almost like a krupuk is what it looks like. More peanuts, 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 peanuts. tempe. Why not? So, so this is the beauty of Indonesia. They don't have potato chips. We got cassava chips and tempeh chips. I had one thing in mind that I wanted to get. It was like the spicy ones. Where are the spicy ones? Oh, the, yeah. I didn't see them. Oh. Uh, there it is. Look at this. Level 15. How could you not? Salamat? Hmm. Hey, do y'all, Astor, is this big? Yes. Big. Oh, it's getting heavy. Bang, bang. Oh, a bang bang. Give me the bang bang. Bang bang. bang, bang. bang, bang. <coughs> oh, is this actually Indonesian? Indonesian, yeah. You get the almond one. I like. Oh, cashew. Almond? I like the cashew, actually. That's the original one. It's cashew. Oh, it's the best. I cheated. I had that one like the first day I was in Indonesia. Sorry, no. What about the better bars? Or these? Mm, I don't know. You don't know? I don't like it. Okay. I I'll try this one. This is the pineapple tart. Okay. So Indonesia. Yeah, next time. Tampons. I'm a little bloated, a little moody. I think it's lack of sleep all the food. So I don't need any of those. You like the snack of those? So random. Yeah. Just random sausage. Just throwing random sausages Good in my one. bag. Random sausages in my bag. I'm gonna need this after all this. Palm sugar latte. Yeah. Any? Uh, thank you. Bye bye. Sweet, let's get out of here. I think it's flickering because the light's like crazy. Whoa. I really don't even want to wait. So I'll get back to our hotel. 
Oh, look at that view. Have a good day. Have a good day. You know what, Sensen? Always on point. <laughs> Always on point. Uh, it's really good. It's like my favorite coffee in Indonesia. You get a little bitterness from the coffee. It's sweet, but they can also make it not sweet for you if you don't want it. It's milky. And the fact that you can get palm sugar in a latte, it's like revolutionary to me. So we checked in to a budget hotel because we got a train ride tonight. And until then, we eat snacks. Yeah. Thank you, Pop. Now the question is, where do you start? I think spicy chips. Who wants some? Spicy chips? I'm okay. Okay. Yeah. Little peanut, a little half bag, and you can do Oh, you got to finish wrapping. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> hmm. I'm gonna get this ready to go. Look at these. Look at the amount of just powder and spice on these. It's not a right away heat. It actually tastes a little bit sweet. Why are these sweet? I feel like they're gonna be hot fries. Like hot fries in America. Like you keep eating them and they just keep getting hotter and hotter and hotter. It's almost like an addictive burn so you can't stop. And taste is very bland. I'm very disappointed in these. I had very high hopes. That's like a six out of 10 for me, unless I get... Okay, the heat's building. Still six. Ooh, man, there's an aroma with the xiao mei. I call them, <laughs> I wanna call them xiu mai. But man, they got a little aroma to them. Nice. And there's a sauce. I guess it's like a little peanut satay sauce. Look at that. I'm not gonna lie y'all, the way I, I poured out that sauce out of that packet, probably the least appealing way I could have ever done that. You want with all the sauce on it here. You know what? They ain't half bad, I kinda like it. Like cut the cost of it. There's barely a touch of meat flavor in there. It's all bready and chewy with the peanut sauce on it. It's sweet. Man, if I was a cheap broke college student again, I think this is what I would get at Indomart. Look at that. Kinda just like this bread. A little kinda chewy. Like the gluten from it's chewy. But I dig it. Man, I give you a lot too. Right here, ion water. This is a low calorie one. We don't get this one in Vietnam. So it counts towards my Indonesian snacks. Now here's where they're gonna get me an Indonesian. I think potato chips, overrated. We got things even better. Cassava and then tempeh. I've never had tempeh, so let's go this. Boom. Oh. I mean, I'm from like, Potato country. Rasta kabai, rawit, tempeh, chilies. Mm. All right, Indonesia. You got your crunchy things down. You got the kurupu, your chips, cassava chips, anything crunchy. Man. Mm. I could snack all day here. A little thick with the soybean, a little tempeh in there. I'm gonna give another seven. The flavor's too mild. And I know how good real tempeh is. Let's keep it going. I don't wanna go sweet yet. I don't wanna like crush my palate with sweetness. So I don't wanna go chip back to back a sausage. Is cheese sausage? Yeah. Oh. Now I don't know about y'all, but I'm not like a, I'm not the type that goes out and just like randomly like picks a single package sausage. This is something I would never pick up by myself. So this is all already here. We'll see how it goes. 
Oh yeah. Can't let that. I gotta be careful how I eat this because if I if I eat like this, people could like Photoshop it, right? Yeah. Gotta be just careful. Eat, eat, uh, like like corn on the cob? No, just take a bite with your hand. <coughs> Yeah, like that. Oh, there it goes. Yeah. Oh, man, that looks... That looks like... You know what this sausage screams? Fourth of July in America. Not that bad. Speaking of Fourth of July, I'm gonna give it a four out of ten. <laughs> I think it's a great transition to our next drink. Day by This is like... This is it. This is what you're gonna get when you get tea. In Indonesia, it's this right here. First, most popular, Rain Supreme. <clears throat> Jasmine tea. Good reason though. Jasmine tea, just the right sweetness, not too sweet. This for me is like a nine out of 10. I could, I'd drink this wow. every day. What's it coated in? Uh, flour and some MSG. See, I thought it was gonna be like krupuk on the outside. Oh, you can you can eat uh, instant noodle and fried rice with that. It's very good. Oh, I feel like I'm not doing it justice. Yeah, so this comes from... From here. Semarang. Oh, Semarang, yeah. Yeah, Semarang. Okay, just a three-hour train ride away. It's a local, local business. See, they just kind of look like candy-coated peanuts. They're like, like peanut yeah, M&M's peanut peanut without the shell <laughs> in the chocolate. Just with the peanut. Yeah? Yeah? I need something with these. I feel like I need a little something else with it. I mean, by themselves, they're like a six and a half, seven for me. I don't like it by itself. I need something. I need a drink with it. I need, you need, none? I need noodles. I need something. You need none? No, because we're going to move on. I got more <laughs> snacks. This video is going to be too long. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I still got like eight things here. Yeah. I saved these for last because I think they're going to be the best. The cassava chips. Original. They're just original flavor. Mm. Mm -hmm. Ooh, big seaweed flavor. Man, prawn crackers, tapioca crackers, cassava chips. So much higher in the ranking for me than potato chips. Yeah, these are like eight and a half. I could eat these every day. Or fry or whatever. Look, you get a little burnt, little crispy ends right there. They're extra crunchy, fibrous. Not so much better than a potato. Okay, I think the bang bang out of all these right here are going to be a bang. Probably my favorite. So I'll put those over there, try to wait. Let's try about this a little wafer. Start with something light. Don't want to start with something too heavy because I don't want to ruin all the other chocolates and desserts. Y'all don't want one or nothing? Y'all don't want to try nothing? Oh my gosh. The box and then the foil. Is this like, I mean a Kit Kat without the chocolate coating? Looks like a Tim Tam. Looks like a Tim Tam without the chocolate coating. It's actually, very malty. My problem with certain things is you get it like this and they dry. This is like grandma's house snack. I feel like if I had a grandma in Indonesia, this is the snack she would have at her house. So cute, small tea. Get a little, I need hot tea. I got the day about that, it's cold. I had a hot tea, a little less sugar in the tea. This right here, talking to grandma, asking how she been, how's her health doing, how she been? Did she do the crossword puzzle today? And eating these. Salama. That's for me, it's good, man. Like. I like it's afternoon snack for sure. I like, it goes seven, half, eight, somewhere around there. There you go. I think they're nice. Let's keep it going with kind of like the crunchy wafer, chocolatey, malty things with the astor. astor. Is this Indonesian? Yeah. Okay. Ari just told me like, this is the Monopoly astor right here. Like anything, you make anything like this, it's an astor. doesn't matter what brand it is. Yeah. That's like calling a Pepsi a Coke. Yes. Boom, right here. Looks like a straw. Mm. It's good for ice cream. Delicious. It's like six and a half for me though because the other ones are so much better for me. I kind of want to get away from the chocolate stuff. So let's break it up. A little pineapple jam. We call it nastar. 
Nah, star. Oh, yeah. Like from ananas tart, pineapple tart, is part of Dutch. Okay. Ananas tart. Oh, ananas. And ananas is pineapple. Yeah. And we serve it during a special occasion like uh, uh, Ramadan. Oh, this is special. <coughs> My problem is the only like little tarts and things like this I've had have been homemade. This looks like a fig bar. You ever seen like them fig bars? Mm -hmm. This is exactly what this looks like. Yes. It's a... Oh, it's crunchy though. Mm, it's pretty good though. Ooh, that kind of light, buttery. Just a nice little tartness from the pineapple. Mmm. Not too sweet. Like a little shortbread crust just crumbles in your mouth. I really like that. I mean, if I had a homemade, it'd be a 10 out of 10, but I'd give those Maybe like a 7.9. Not quite an 8. But they're pretty good. Oh, yeah. oh I forgot they're hard. Mm. It's candy, man. Mm. It's milky. Yeah. I'm not a big hard candy guy, though. Okay. I don't like hard candy, but... I mean, I eat it. It's just like mocha. The reason I don't like hard candies, though, is because I'm not patient. I want to sit there and chew it, and it just gets stuck in my teeth like toffee or something, or like some peanut brittle. I'm not got copy co all up in my teeth. Now I got the two things I was looking most forward to. A bang bang and this right here. I already know what this is gonna be. So let's get the bang bang out. Man, that is like some American packaging right there. I had this, I said, I think that thing's gonna be as big as this right here. Now look at that right there. That ain't nothing. Bro, this looks good. It just keeps getting smaller and smaller. Ooh, wafer and caramel and chocolate and rice krispies. the rice krispies for the texture. Mmm, it's actually like Twix and Snickers had a baby. You get the caramel, it's like ooey and gooey, but you get like that wafer, a chocolate coating. I like that. Mmm, it's a little heavier than a Kit Kat but not quite as just heavy as a Snickers that hits right in the middle for me. Eight and a half, I love that. So this is the Silver Queen. And it's definitely a queen because it's one of the best of the best. We got the original, the cashew, chocolate bar. This come from Indonesia? Come from Indonesia. Bandung yeah. is where it's manufactured. But look right here. Hmm. Everybody all about Hershey's bars and Hershey's with almonds. But I'm about this right here because you get cashews. Them cashews, dog. Mmm, so much better than an almond. Oh yeah. Mmm. Oh yeah. Cashews. Nine and a half out of ten. That's me right there. I'm not a big chocolate bar guy, but I could eat a little bit of that every day. All right. I want to be able to do this for a long time. So I wanted to make sure to vary up what I get. I had to get some healthy stuff as well. Audrey's about to explain about this because I don't know what the heck's going on here. What is this? That we call this a larutan penyegar. So if you have heat in the body, like a heatiness, after playing <laughs> in the sun, or if you consume a type of food that gives uh, heat to your body. Like lots of Indonesian snacks? Like a lot of uh, snacks and a lot of uh, sambal. Mm. You need something to cool your body down. So we sometimes we drink this. We call it larutan penyegar. There's so many brands. One of it, one of it is like the rhinoceros bread, and actually you pick my favorite uh, flavor here. Like I saw it. Yeah, lychee. So enjoy, Max. Why didn't you give this to me last night when I had level twenty-five sambal? <laughs> oh yeah. Ooh. Oh, it's actually nice. Is that coconut water? It doesn't yeah, taste like coconut water, but it's like it's got that layer of refreshing. Like, I really do feel it kind of cool off my body a little bit. I know it sounds crazy. Like from roots and everything. Mm. They have the normal flavor. We just, uh, just like, just this like water. Right. Just plain water. But with herbs. And... With herbs in it. But yeah. then uh, the company put the flavors will attract people more to drink it. Mm. Like, like uh, orange, lime, strawberries, grape, and my favorite lychee. Well, I like this because it's like, it's lychee flavor and it may have all those herbs to help you health wise, but it ain't taste like them. I mean, it ain't like Jammu. It ain't like. <laughs> This right here, which I'm not a fan of, but I just hey, want to show y'all. Take care of the onion. All right, throw like onion. You want to take one? I'll take the rest. Take one and take the rest of the box. <laughs> Except you want to bring it to, to the state. Huh? It's all you, no? It's all you, man. It's I knew you would. 
You like it more than me, so. Thank you for everything. Been coming, I know. It's like gold. Yeah. For you. So true. So, it's very like, it's not paste. It's not thick enough to be a paste. It's like runny toothpaste. I'll show you. Don't just describe it like that. Oh, my dick is, look it's at like it. It's like honey. Oh, look at that. It is runnier. It's like honey. Ooh. The thing gets me. It's just a massive amount of peppermint in it, so it does taste like toothpaste to me, but <laughs> it's got all types of herbs, honey. It's supposed to be great. It actually yeah. is when it goes down your throat and into your stomach. It makes you feel like a new person, or at least different. <laughs> it's just so much peppermint and honey together. It's like chugging good toothpaste. You, it's just like good you, buddy. chugging toothpaste <laughs> with honey and sugar. Whew. No sugar in it. It's Indonesian no snacks, y'all. Let me know what I miss. And what I tried. Scientifically proven. I'm sure it is. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure. I'm sure the like onion did not put the scientifically proven on that. Um, but anyways, let me know what snacks I missed. What should I had? Quick one. About the rest for three hours. Cause then I got. Is it first class or luxury? Luxury sleeper suite. Luxury sleeper sleeper suite train. So. We'll see you at the next video.